morning. Where are we? Blizzard Beats. Yay. Come out from the towel. Ooh. <laughs> Tell us about your coffee this morning. Oh, that Houston blend that our friend sent us was amazing. It, sm it made the whole entire apartment smell delicious. Yes, and it had, like, I was nervous because it was like pecan flavored beans with like, with coconut flakes in it, and I was like, it's not really going to give it much coconut flavor. It, it smelled like coconut, it tastes like coconut. I just drank it black. No cream or nothing. It was so good. Thank you. <laughs> you still feel seasick? <laughs> Did you get lost? <laughs> Look at this wave pool. It's much smaller than Typhoon Lagoons, but it's just like constant. And it doesn't go deeper than 5'6. But right here is crazy because both waves like meet there and it's like whiplash all the time. And that right there is what I'm going on later. Right? Yeah. You going on it with me? I beat you. You did? Yeah. Did I get one? Why did I ever get one? <laughs> medium Sarah this is the that salsa about Texas and Sarah I haven't tried it yet Sarah just tried it and said it is hot I like spicy stuff so I thought when I get my first my first chip full of it on the vlog it's very tasty I don't think it's as hot as, as Sarah made it seem like it's got spice to it, but it's not hot. Are you crazy? It's hot. So we have a very important update. We left Blizzard Beach. I split someone else's head open. I'm just joking. I didn't. We left. We had a fun, awesome day at Blizzard Beach. We went on five, all five of the, the slides. We didn't go on... Steamboat Springs? Yeah, so Steam there's boat six, Springs? there's, I think there's six. How rude is that model? Um, there's six slides there, we went on five of them because we didn't go on Steamboat, Steamboat, Steamboat. 
Team, Team Boat, Boat Springs. Springs. Team Boat Springs, you can hold the whole family in this puppy. We know there's a Mickey Mouse party, Halloween party tonight. Just a Mickey Mouse party. But we're going to Magic Kingdom anyway, just for a few hours because it's Sunday and it's Sunday. She thinks she's cool with her sunglasses on. I got an espresso from Grand Floridian, so thank you, Grand Floridian. It got hot out. We were having, it was like the perfect morning for Blizzard Beach because it was overcast. It wasn't sweltering hot to like burn you up while you were waiting in line for the rides. And it wasn't even that busy there. Yeah. The longest ride we had was that double down, team double down race thing. For the most part, it was quick rides. Yeah. We had a great time. It was good. I still think Typhoon Lagoon's way better. Join the parade. We don't want them. We That's why you just love the little things. It's stuff like that. Sarah, Sarah hates getting put on a spot, but you throw some patriotic stuff her way, <laughs> and, she, and she'll sign up in a heartbeat. She was ready to go the second the guy pulled those that stack of little flags on. She got to keep it. I was in a parade. On Main Street USA. So in the case where we were using the app, it had crashed and it wouldn't let us do any fast passes. There are kiosks throughout the park that you can go to and select fast passes for. So this one is right by Stitch's Great Escape. <laughs> we are getting that right there. Pretending like we are going to this Halloween party, right? What? We're pretending like we're going to the Halloween party? Mm. Ooh, look at her. She's already feeling re-energized. How is it? Really good. It's uh, 4.25 for one. Soft serve 
candy. I don't even like candy corn. I love candy corn, and Sarah won't even let us buy any at the store. No, I will. You <laughs> just have to be in charge of eating it. That's fine. I did that when we lived with your mom's. She'd buy like 16 pounds of it, and I'd eat every pound. Well, that's what it looks like. Where's my flag? In oh. your back pocket. That's what the candy, candy, candy corn, candy can. Yours is gonna melt if you don't start. Candy eating. corn ice cream cone looks like because mine's gonna be gone in about now. That was delicious. We only got to nine. <laughs> I barely walked, maybe 200 feet, and it was gone. How do you, I love it? I yeah, want um, really the second, third, and fourth tonight. So it's really cool. We're not going to the Halloween party. Which is advertised for Halloween. But it's on the sign. It's actually it's on like the permanent sign, but we're not sure if it's a permanent item or not. That's really an easy sign to take out though. Yeah. Maybe just for the fall. Yeah. It's super good. I suggest getting it if you need a four dollar cooler offer sweet treat and you like candy cane, candy corn. Um Splash Mountain. Please feel better. Get well soon. Get well soon. Don't know what's going on with that little greenhouse effect they're going that they have going on right now. Maybe it's been raining. Maybe they're doing something that has to get stay dry. But she's seen better days, that's for sure. No better way to cool off and to enjoy some quality, good old entertainment, right, Sarah? Yes. <laughs> the cast member's playing the harmonica. Yeah, the cast member was playing it. Look at that. That is magic right there. What do you call a grizzly bear in the North Pole? Lost. <laughs> Howdy folks, how are we doing today? Woohoo! You know, I just told you these amazing bear jokes and that's the, the answer you're going to give me. So now we're going to try that one more time. I said, howdy folks, how are we doing today? Much better, that's what I love to hear y'all. Welcome to Grizzly Hall, home of the one and only Country Bear Jamboree. Um, jungle cruise there was a lot of big big tree trunks you could tell that that's why it was down for so long after the hurricane because they had to do a lot of chopping up cutting up and cleaning up it was crazy but now it's so much fun because now the, the people who have tickets to the Hollywood party can come into the park because I think after four they're allowed to come in as their like general mission almost and now we can see all of the costumes and there are some good ones. There was a whole family of like 10 people. There were different emojis. And then what else did we see? A bunch of wilderness explorers. Oh, Mickey Mouse. Stitch and um, Sprung. And Mouseketeers, a whole clan of Mouseketeers. Oh my lord. That is not just a beautiful castle, but if you look at something right there, you know what that is? What is that, sir? Christmas lights and this crane right over here behind this wall that crane is for the installation of Christmas lights on the castle and I can't wait though we were just talking a second ago of if we're gonna do a second Halloween party and and when are we gonna do that we think if we do one it'll be a Sunday because all of the Fridays are sold out in October so we'll figure it out we will see if we're gonna do a second one and let everybody know I want to do a second one because because it, we did the first one and it was in August. And it was, there's a baby. There's a baby at the pot. The sword is down. I think. Look how cute that little baby is. Oh. So unfortunately, it's coming towards the end of our Sunday night, since we're not going to the Halloween party. But today, Diamond Diamond Horseshoe 
yeah. Lemon Horseshoe in Frontierland was open, and they had, I think it's a newer menu. It's a, it's usually like a seasonally not always open restaurant, but they have an quick all you service. can eat. It was a quick service before. Oh, it was quick service, yeah. But now they have an all you can eat option where it's like good southern, like cold pork, comfort yeah. food. Yeah. Thirty five dollars for adults, and I think it was twenty. I think it was nineteen or seventeen for kids. For kids. But they, the cool thing was, I don't think a lot of people know that it's even open because we had walked, just walked up and they There's were... Herc. Oh my god. Um, that they were about to seat us even though we didn't have a reservation because not that many people know about it. But we are sitting in front of Tony's where the bypass is to go get you like your tickets and, and, and candy bags for the party and we just want to see some of the costumes tonight. And we'll do there's a wonderful some job. Ones. Yeah. Some people we make We saw like a home like a made at home flick. But that was really good. Yeah. We're just gonna relax and look at the costumes. So we decided since we have been doing, as you've seen, we've done a few dinners or, or like nice sit down services with friends. We've done a lot of little things like sharing a lot of quick service meals or sharing a lot of food and wine. We haven't actually done like a nice sit down, almost like a date night, if you want to call it that. Besides our anniversary. Besides our anniversary. Where did we go from there? Um, the Pali, it was Kona Cafe. Yes, it was delicious. But we're thinking maybe we're gonna go somewhere to eat soon. It's not saying this is gonna be it, but we've never actually been to uh Marcuzzi's. Marcuzzi's. So we came to check out the menu and we saw the brunch, but we wanted to see what else they offered for dinner. This is what your hair looks like after a day at the water park in the Magic Kingdom. But unfortunately, it's Sunday night, which means as you're watching this, I'm probably at work right now. Mm-hmm. And that's a bummer. I got a real bad case of the Sunday blues. I think it was because we had such a good weekend. Eve's getting into trouble, I think. Sarah's going to go grab her. But we want to thank you for following along our adventures today. Um, we haven't been to Blizzard Beach since 2011. So that was a lot of fun. And then definitely didn't expect to go to Magic Kingdom. That was really... We had a lot of fun with, like with the Philharmonic, with the Dapper Dance, didn't expect to see them, and then the Flag Retreat. It was a lot of unexpected, quick little fun at Magic Kingdom. So thank you again for following along with us. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Subscribe. We love when people subscribe and they come back and watch watch our, our everyday little magic, little, little adventures we go on. So we appreciate it. And uh, leave a comment down below. Right now we're still at a point where we can do a good job at trying to comment back and as much as we can. And so with that, it's good to be home. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>